Welcome back, friends. Corey from Wondering Weekends here, coming to you from the office. And I wanted to address a comment that we get quite consistently on our towing videos. And that is, hey, why do you have a three-quarter ton truck to tow a 7,500-pound travel trailer? It has nothing to do with payload. It has nothing to do with tow capacity. We're going to talk about it in this video. Stay tuned. All right, so I'm sure you're thinking, okay, if you're not gonna talk about tow capacity, which is kind of useless when it comes to travel trailers, and you're not gonna talk about payload, which is more important, but doesn't have anything to do with this, what are you gonna talk about? Well, I'll tell you, and it's what I've been told is called lateral drag, and basically the lateral drag that the sidewalls of our travel trailer produce. We have a 32-foot travel trailer, and I'll link some, I'm not an engineer, I don't get into algebra and equations, I hate that stuff but I will link in the description box below. It'll basically let you know that a 32 foot travel trailer is gonna have four times the lateral drag, basically the pushing and pulling of that trailer that a 16 foot travel trailer would have. So you would think 16 foot, 32 foot, okay, you got double the lateral drag, but no, actually it's exponential. It goes up four times, it's four times the amount. And same thing for wind. So if you think that a 10 mile an hour wind or 20 mile an hour wind only pushes twice as hard as a 10 mile an hour wind. Actually, it's four times as hard, and you'll, I'll link all of that in the description box below. You can look it up yourself. Don't take my word for it. I'm not an engineer. I'm just a hillbilly with a YouTube channel. Basically, my experience tells me that I don't want to tow our travel trailer with a half ton truck. I've been there, done that. I had a, a Super Crew F-150 with an EcoBoost. From a dead start, got it going just fine, and even stopped it fine. But when you're going down the road, the back end gets floaty and it's all of those forces on those sidewalls. So you got 32 foot travel trailers, you got 36 foot travel trailers. They're starting to come out with 38 foot travel trailers. And while most of them come under the numbers technically for a half ton truck, stability wise, your rear end on that half ton is gonna be all over the place. And so that's why we tow with a three quarter ton truck. Yes, it's nice to have the extra payload. We got a huge cushion when it comes to payload. And obviously we're well under our towing capacity but it's the sidewalls that make a difference. And the reason I say that, another example I give some folks is, if you're towing a boat, obviously you can tow a larger boat with a half ton, and you're not gonna get that dancing around like you do with a travel trailer because you don't have those flat sidewalls on each side. Air can pass under, pass over, it's not a big deal. So obviously, same thing with a flatbed, landscape trailer, whatever else. Cargo trailers, you may have that issue, but a lot of times they'll sit a lot lower, so you don't have the, the issue of the air running underneath. Again, I'm not an engineer, I'll link some some tools for you to look at in the description box. You can look it up for yourself. But that is the reason that we tow with a three quarter ton truck. And we try to suggest to people, hey, anything over 26 feet overall length, from your pin, your from your, your ball, all the way back to your bumper, anything over 26 foot, you're really gonna think about a three quarter ton truck regardless of your weight. Uh, obviously you're gonna be well under your weights for most half tons, but that sidewall is the real issue. So please share this. It's gonna save people a ton of problems. I, I can't tell you how many people have reached out to us and said, hey, you were right. Like We started with a half ton, but really realized really quickly that we needed a three quarter ton truck. It just wasn't, it, it didn't feel solid. It didn't feel stable. We definitely moved up to three quarter ton truck and it made a huge difference. And the three quarter ton is how it's supposed to feel. Uh, and, and please don't, in the comment section, please don't bring up adjusting my hitch. I've adjust, I know how to adjust a hitch. I'm well aware on how to do that. My hitches are just fine. And uh, But yeah, it does just you just need more truck sometimes. That's all there is to it. So I hope this video was useful. Please share this video. If, if there's one video that travel trailer, potential travel trailer owners need to see more than any other, it might be this one. Uh, it could save them a lot of headaches in the future. So please share. It always helps the channel. And consider subscribing. See ya.